high school football teams start playing games this week, but not all of them. You heard earlier in this newscast, seven games have already been canceled or postponed because of the virus. And it might be just the beginning of a problem that's going to be with us a while. Schools are trying to do the right thing, trying to keep the kids safe. But the ignorant arguments of the anti-vaxxers are making that an almost impossible job. The only possible way to stop the spread of the virus is with a mask and a shot. But that is apparently asking too much of too many, so we cancel the games instead. Dallas ISD Athletic Director Dr. Sylvia Salinas joined me earlier tonight to talk about this. Dr. Salinas, is this just the beginning of a year-long problem? We were hoping that it wasn't. We were hoping we we're out of the out of the clear and, or in the clear now, but um, that's not the case. And so we learned a lot from last year and we're just ready and better prepared to, uh, to host events and make sure our, our coaches and kids are safe. Why don't you require vaccinations uh, from every kid who wants to play sports you know, like you do for other vaccinations to go to school? I'll leave that up to the top decision makers. Um, as the FDA made that decision yesterday, um, we're just gonna make sure that in Dallas ISD Athletics, our events are uh, safe for spectators, fans, and, and parents. We wanna make sure our coaches and kids are safe. And we're gonna do uh, make take the uh, necessary safety adjustments to ensure that, and just hopeful that the current landscape uh, changes. Have there been any discussions about the possibility of not playing any games? No, we're going to take that case by case. Um, we're contact tracing. We're doing all the things and protocols that we had in place last year. And we're making sure that we um, we continue to communicate that and masks and self-screening. That's one of the things that uh, the key uh, components of, of curbing the uh, the virus is to make sure that kids don't show up if they're they're showing symptoms or have been around somebody who has. Dr. Salinas, uh, I know you're not a medical doctor, uh, but your education level exceeds most of us. So why is it so hard to educate so many about the dangers of COVID-19? Well, certainly not a health expert, that's for sure. And the the, the it's it's a national debate, and I don't want to really get into that, um, as it is not unique to Dallas. Um, but we are here to educate students for success, and we're here to provide the best athletic experience possible for not only our coaches and, and, and student athletes, but our, our spectators and fans and officials. We want to make sure that we provide a safe environment, and we're going to keep doing that until we're out of the clear. Dallas uh, Schools Athletic Director Dr. Sylvia Salinas. Cowboys owner Jerry Jones is joining the Get the Vaccine Party now. Says when your decision impacts others, the common good takes over. Says we need to check I at the door and go forward with we. Well, I think he should require the vaccine to go to a Cowboys game like the Raiders do. But I'm betting we don't ever see that.